Um, hi, this is a s uh, small project I've been doing for a uh, while. I've been using this quite a bit because of its portability. Uh, it's my uh, emergency jump start uh, with compressor and um, 115 volt outlet. You can see it has a USB port in here as well that I can use. Anyway, I converted this to uh, a really small compressor. It's one of those uh, uh, Wagon Tech type compressors that I uh, have at my disposal. And I just cut off the, the tip of this and put one of the uh, uh, pressure switch on top of it. And uh, the female outlet right there. And uh, it's very um, convenient for me because of its light and its portability. I don't have to plug it in or, or uh, carry it to uh, uh, a crawl space or something. But uh, it works pretty well. All I need to uh, operate my, my Brad Mailer is um, actually 50 PSI, but I put this all the way up to uh, 80 PSI and uh, adjust the, uh, the uh, pressure switch in here so that it turns it off at 80 PSI. Um, I'm going to turn it on. It's going to be a little bit noisy, so uh, watch it. See right there, it stops at around 80 psi. It might not be uh, actually it's 85 psi. You might not be able to see it from here, but it works pretty good. Um, it activates. Uh, it, it, it turns back on um, after I do the shot, but that's all I need anyway. It's a small um, portable device for me because uh, I, I need to carry it everywhere. So this is my Brad Brad Mailer, and I'll try it right now. I just want to show it to you uh, as soon as I get it there. See, it uh, goes all the way through. Oh, the other one is left in the table itself. Anyway, um, to make it even better, you can uh, recycle one of those old propane tank, the small ones that I have, and uh, connect it over here so that it'll pressurize it and it'll probably take about uh, five to ten shots before the uh, the uh, uh, compressor kicks in again it is very useful like I said because it's very portable and I can carry it with me anywhere because of its uh, very light configuration and I can still use it to uh, jump start my car or inflate my tires um, using my, my uh, converted um, um, port in there and at the same time you had your USB charger here I disconnected my um, my 300 or 400 watt 115 volts that was hooked up in here I, I, I don't need it that much so it's not like it's taking a lot of weight but I took it out anyway so uh, you saw it here first. I don't know if this is the first one. I've s I haven't seen one like this yet. But if you try to make a business out of this, I need my cut, man. So anyway, I'll post some more videos about this, um, which will include the uh, tire inflation and probably how to convert it, or how do I convert this? Alright, signing off.